What is up, Rasa? How are you guys doing? It is Insomnia from the Mexican Gamers Channel, and I am back with some Beast Confirmed gameplay. <laughs> some Modern Warfare 3 gameplay, some Beast Confirmed, like El Presidor would say. But yeah, this is some Kill Confirmed. I'm using the PP... I, I forgot what the hell this, this gun is called. I really haven't taken time to learn the names of the guns that have a lot of uh, a lot of numbers and, and words and stuff like that, random stuff. <laughs> I, I forgot. Um, maybe I'll remember later, but, you know, Excadi's always called this a Dodo gun, so I guess we'll go with that. So I'm using the dodo gun with the red dot sight it's pretty lethal don't get me wrong this this uh, gun isn't to be taken lightly it's pretty lethal um but yeah i recently turned up my sensitivity to sensitivity 4 because i find that modern warfare 3 you know this game you die so fast man so extremely fast that lower sensitivities really don't help you out all that much because lower sensitivities what they do is they usually help you out with your aim with accuracy you know you're, you're able to stay on target a little bit better um, and higher sensitivities are more for like more twitch you know just turn on a guy super fast if he's behind you and uh, I find that Modern Warfare 3 is you know it's kind of necessary of that I was finding that with the 2 sensitivity you know it was it really wasn't helping me out all that much because like I said you die super fast so if a guy shoots you in the back you need to be able to turn around really really quick and you know shoot him back and I find with 4 sensitivity hopefully I could I could get uh, you know get a little bit better at that and uh, yeah, so my first game, you know, switching to Force Sensitivity, I played it a little while ago. Now it was a 31 and 1 uh, with the ACR, uh, so which isn't, you know, that hard to do. With the ACR is, is an extremely accurate gun, super powerful, it's an assault rifle, so, you know, it has medium long range, it's perfect, uh, pretty good fire rate, so, you know, it, it was really, really good. But what I really wanted to do this commentary about, because I had already, already recorded this before. But I spent the whole game talking about sensitivities, and I spent the whole time talking about the gameplay, um, which you know isn't something that I really, really want to do all the time. Uh, you know, sometimes it's it's alright, but you know, I really wanted to ask because I was curious, man. With Skyrim, Skyrim just released a little, uh, you know, a couple. I think it was like not even a week ago. Not exactly sure though, so I'm sorry, but yeah, probably a week ago, a little bit more. But uh, anyways, I think it was on Thursday. Damn, now, I, now, now I'm confused. But yeah, Skyrim released recently. So I was wondering if any of you guys are playing it because, I mean, I, I thought about it. I was like, well, I mean, should I even consider it? Not for now. I'm not going to buy it now because, you know, I, I just bought Modern Warfare 3. That's how I really am playing whenever I get the chance to play because I have school and work. But whenever I really get the chance to play, then I, I play Modern Warfare 3 with my friends because that's what my friends are playing. So I want to play with my friends, man. It's it's a fun time playing playing with some peeps. For some of your buddies, so that's what I really what I want to be doing right now. But you know, later on when I start getting bored of Modern Warfare 3, I just passed the campaign by the way of Modern Warfare 3. It's awesome, man! Awesome campaign. Um, and uh, yeah, so uh, yeah, I was wondering, like, well, maybe because I, I've never been into the, the, those type of games like magic games, I've never been into like Oblivion or or um, I don't know, just Skyrim, any of the Elder Scroll ga Scrolls games, I've never really played them. Um, but you know a lot of people are talking you know, wonders of Skyrim and uh, I was wondering like Are any of you guys playing it or what are you playing right now? Are you still playing Battlefield 3? Are you still playing Black Ops maybe because you haven't gotten Modern Warfare 3 and um, or Modern Warfare 2 I don't know. I'm just curious. What are you guys playing right now? Um, I, I really want to know because I was, I was getting curious. I was like well I mean a lot of people are playing Modern Warfare 3 for the obvious reasons. It's the new game So everyone's on it right now. My friends list is like all I see is Modern Warfare 3, Modern Warfare 3, Modern Warfare 3 Battlefield 3 <laughs> and then Modern Warfare 3, more Modern Warfare 3. So everyone's really seems to be playing Modern Warfare 3 at least in my PSN's friend list and um, I don't know I got curious. I was like, huh? I wonder what everyone else is playing or anyone else is playing something You know that isn't really new. I, I I thought about buying the new Batman game because it looks awesome I saw I'm watching the X X cow playthrough on Batman Arkham City and I, I thought about buying Arkham Asylum first and passing that you know Maybe in December and Christmas when you know, I start maybe maybe getting a little bored of Modern Warfare 3 I'm not sure though um, Excuse me because I'm still a little sick but yeah, I thought about maybe buying Batman Arkham Asylum first and then later buying Batman Arkham City. Uh, that game looks awesome. I'm, I'm a huge Batman fan. I <laughs> That was my favorite um, superhero when I was a little boy. But uh, yeah, and then it was Spider-Man. Spider-Man Spider -Man was awesome. The thing I liked about Spider-Man that he was a nerd and then he's still like a badass. You know, he's a superhero, so he kicks ass. I thought that was pretty pretty cool. You know, he because all superheroes like Superman, he's super good looking and... 
you know, he's uh, Batman. He's super, he's good looking and he's rich, and then he's a badass. So Spider Man, he was a nerd. He really, he really he was kind of loser. He was kind of a loser, and then he's a badass as a superhero. So I thought that was pretty awesome. But yeah, anyways, I don't know how I started talking about superheroes. What's your f favorite superhero? That that's also an interesting question. That would I like to know because a lot of people go for Superman. And I think Superman, Superman's overrated, man. The dude, he cheats, man. He he has like all the superpowers and I don't know. I'm just not a big fan of Superman. I think Batman is awesome though. He's he's a badass. And uh, what? Look at this. I, I was pissed when this happened, man. I was I was raging. I was playing in a party with Reaper and look at that. What? Here I am just standing there like uh just knifing random things for no reason. But uh, yeah, I was I was pissed, man. The, that's one thing that has really seems to be happening. There's a lot of frame rate on the PS3 now. I already tweeted Robert Bowling, Robert Bowling, the community manager for Infinity Ward, to hey man, I let him know. I was like, hey Rob, there's a lot of lag issues on the PS3, so you might want to look into that, brother. But obviously he didn't he didn't really respond. Um, they kind of neglect the PS3 a lot. So, um, yeah, I, I, this game was made for Xbox and it was ported to PS3 and PC. So I guess, you know, it is going to be best on Xbox, but at least they can make it work right on the PS3. But anyways, yeah, that's about it, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this gameplay of Beast Confirmed. Um, yeah, more videos to come, so stick around. Hopefully you guys enjoy your Friday, because I'm I sure that I will. And uh, yeah, I have a test and I have to go work. So And then after that, then I guess I'll enjoy it. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. 23 and 2 was my final score, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.